Alpha TIG 200X foot pedal, foot control. It's got a seven pin connector here. Two of the connectors turn the torch on. There's three of them that go to a 10K pot. This is a 2016 model. This is the foot pedal. Taking the four bolts off for the top. That clicking noise is the on off switch, which is the contacts one and two. This is looking at the end of the connector from the foot pedal, not the uh, welder. One and two are actually labeled on here. It's called a GX27 pin. You have to be careful, there's one that's slightly smaller if you want to make your own pedal, but this is GX20 is a size 20 millimeter. One and two, that's the contact here. The 10K pot here, potential resistor here is across five and three, measures 10K. And the up position here, it's at the other upper end here, the wiper. When you put the pedal down like this, it'll go from 10K down to zero if you measure between three and four. So I'm going to connect this between three and four over here. And then I'm going to go over here and here's the pedal. So I push this down all the way down here at zero. That's what varies the current. Clicking noise is the switch turning on, and then here's the wiper. It's moving up and down. The wiper is over here. This is the 10K pot that's on the side. This is on a 2016 pedal, an Alpha Tig 200X, and it does have a current control over here between these two pins. Six and seven are connected together. I'm not sure what that is. That may be that it lets it know that it does have a foot control is what I think it happens. So uh, there is a connection inside this plug between six and seven. And I believe this that allows the welder to know that it has a foot control in in use.